The Sac State men's basketball team has been on a tear to start the season. Actually, I'm putting that nicely. Basically, what they've been doing to opponents is what Jake Paul did to Nate Robinson, knocking them out. Sac State facing Idaho for the second time in three days, and the Vandals clearly didn't want this smoke. Idaho would jump out to a 6-0 lead right out the gate, but just like the McRib, Sac State would come back. Early in the first half, Bryce Fowler getting jiggy with it. He slices through defenders for the bucket. And just a few minutes later, Fowler again, this time with the two-handed jam. Fowler led the Hornets with 17 points in the game, but he wasn't doing it all by himself. Later in the half, Ethan Esposito doing work in the paint. He had 14 points and 11 boards on the day. Now this team can shoot too. Don't believe me, just watch. Early in the second half, Christian Terrell from three, no diggity, no doubt. And watch him play the air guitar right here. Yeah, Terrell was three or four from three point range. He had 15 points on the day. Play on player. The Hornets go on to sting the Vandals 73 to 57. Sac State moves to three and zero on the season and two and zero in conference play. Coach, your thoughts. I think our guys learned some real good lessons today. We told them that this is the all-time all deal. It's hard to beat somebody twice in a year, and it's really hard to beat somebody twice in 36 hours. It doesn't matter who it is on this level. We didn't come out with the energy that we wanted to. Uh, it was real emphasis for us because it was an early game today. And uh, coming off our win uh, versus I don't know, we knew that they are going to have a lot of energy to start the games. Stingers up.